kick it off to start the second half. He's going to return it from near the goal line. Gets it to the 25-yard line. That's where they start the drive. And the Trojans' offense is back out on the field. They get the second half started with a running play. That's a solid gain. Moves the ball to the 29. Hat on the hat up front. Good job of opening up the holes. Anytime you can get positive yards on first down, that's a win. Finds his man. It's Torres. They bring him down to the 45 at a solid gain to keep this drive going. First down and 10 now. There's the snap. Looking to throw the ball. The ball is caught. They make the tackle, but that pass creates a solid gain. Oh, the running back that time just kind of sneaks out of the backfield and shows his hands on that nice catch. And they'll run it out of the shotgun. Look, I realize on any play call, when it's properly executed, it can go to the house for a touchdown. But the runs that really make a game plan work are the ones where you get just what you need. And he barely got the first down, but he got it. They get him down, but that's a solid game. I know this defense worked very hard at halftime to come up with answers on how to try to slow down this running back after the big first half. And he's already at it again. And the defense able to hold him there to a short game. Critical third down play for this offense right here. Looking to pick up the first down through the air. Short connection to the tight end here. Moves the football to the 30. Good enough for a first down. And the Trojans come to the line to set a fresh set of downs. And off here from the shotgun. Now this is the eighth play on this drive. They'll go with the ground game here. Running back takes the handoff. And the senior able to make the stop after a short gain. Chris, you know, the spread era over the years has always grown offensively, but I've been always impressed with defenses that really build their defense to play in space and still have an ability to be sound at the line of scrimmage and defend a running game. It's exactly what we saw right there. And here comes the noise. This crowd is trying to inspire this defense to make a big red zone stop. I'll take that every single time. Offensive line does a nice job up front. This back's vision and ability to get positive yards by lowering his pads on full display right there. He'll be brought down just a few inches short of that first down mark. So here we go. Third down in the red zone. The kind of play that decides football games. And the Trojans offense is on the move now. How impressive have these guys been up front today? Big third down, know what you need to do, get the first down, continue to hold on to that lead, continue to work clock, and get that much closer to securing a victory. And this big crowd doing everything possible to inspire this defense down, and he runs it in for the score. Touchdown, USC. And they'll set up with a PAT. The extra point is good, and they stretch the lead a little bit more. The kickoff team on the field now is a get set to send this one away. USC, 28, Notre Dame, 10. Return, run out The fighting Irish offense is back on the field. Get set, get set. Looking to throw it on first down. Makes a quick grab. And the defense swarms. Not much of a gain on that completion. Second down play coming up. They'll hand it off. A change of direction. Makes the first down, but pays a price. Big hit there at the end. A running play gives the offense a fresh set of downs. And looking to throw now on first down. It's an out route, the catch made. A huge hit by the linebacker, a collision of big bodies there. What's the play call here on second down for this offense? And the ball is handed off out of the shotgun. Looks like Notre Dame will have the first down. How aggressive do you get on first and 10? Well, it's a nice job up front by the offensive line, but give the running back an assist for setting those blocks up before he's able to get downfield for the first down. 
And they tackle him, but not before he picks up the first. A running play gives the offense a fresh set of downs. And here's the handoff. And they'll bring him down after just a short pickup. Looks like a man is down on the field after the last play, so we'll take a timeout. It's a quarterback keeper. They'll stop him behind the line for a loss of one. Well, they keep trying to run the football, and they keep getting dominated at the line of scrimmage. That has been a theme throughout this entire game. We've talked about it earlier in the game. It's not changing at all. They've become one-dimensional, and I think it's allowed this defense to really lock in on that quarterback. Takes the football inside the 30, and that's a first down. A running play gives the offense a fresh set of downs. Off the play fake on first down. He'll avoid the big hit with the slide. Well, they did a good job of getting pressure on the quarterback, but, man, make the play. Bring him down. Instead, they give up positive yards here on the scramble. Receiver looks it in. It's complete. Defense reacts quickly. A very short gain on the play. Coming to the line on second down. This is important. They want to avoid a third and long. He'll hand it off. And he's finally tackled after three defense getting pushed backwards. Notre Dame lining up now for a first and goal. And the quarterback dropping back. He's got it right near the end zone. And he's in. Touchdown, Irish. That's a crucial score. Let's see if they can build momentum and complete this comeback. Well, I know they're still trailing, but that score is a great first step in trying to break down this lead. You don't want to leave it all to the fourth quarter when the pressure really intensifies and you have limited time. You're returning from inside the 10-yard line. And he stopped at the 20. Tried to make something happen, but that's good coverage there. And here comes the USC offense back on the field. Great possession last time. They punch it into the end zone. Can the defense come up with a stop this time? You know, offensive linemen are just a certain breed. They're always going to do their job, no matter who's back there carrying the ball. I'll tell you what, they have a little bit more confidence when the person that's carrying the ball can break off some big-time runs. That makes them block just a little bit harder, knowing that he's potentially capable of doing it. Here's the handoff. Breaks loose at the 40. And they'll move the six on that one. It's a first down to the 42. And the Trojans come to the line to start a fresh set of downs. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. Goes backwards, losing three yards there. There's that excellent linebacker with a clear path just running downhill quickly. You know, I think one of the great things about watching this guy play all year is his vision. He just has great instincts. 